you pay around $20 a month and they will send you bring it up come on this is what I have to deal with trying to record and um, it's time to play fetch right <laughs> come here My dog is a menace, I swear. Oh, well now you're not getting it back. <laughs> she pushed it off the couch. What are you gonna do? Hey guys, Jumi of Diamonds here with another month of Loot Crate. If you don't know what Loot Crate is, it is a monthly subscription service where you pay around $20 a month and they will send you an assortment of items which tie into that monthly theme. Uh, this month's theme was Quip. Um, that, I think that's really the only clue they gave was Equip. I'm not really sure what is going to be in here this month. Uh, it's completely unopened. I just got it earlier today and I have been dying to see what's inside this month so we are going to dive right in now I don't have scissors with me this time so bear with me I'm gonna have to unfortunately rip the box who needs scissors when you have fingernails seriously all right So, this is what the inside of the box looks like before actually going into it. Um, just going to start picking away at the top. The top thing is my looter card, which I have been waiting for for three months now. Thank you, Loot Crate, for finally signing this to me. So I am an official member. Um, Oh, no way! Wait. Wait, what is this? So, they have sent me a pure Nintendo gift card. You redeem it at purenintendo.com slash magazine. It has a code and then it says, I think it's good for $10. It's a free one year to the magazine, but I thought, is this... Nintendo Power? Because didn't they shut down? I guess it wouldn't be. I'm gonna have to check this out. This is actually really cool. Um, I actually do like gaming magazines. Like, I'm subscribed already to Game Informer and I get that monthly, so I'll have to check this out. I mean, I'm not really one for digital, but I, I don't mind digital. That's totally fine with me. Alright, here's the cheat sheet. Uh, we'll come back to this at the end, because I don't want to- I don't want to spoil anything. <laughs> So, the first thing that I see, actually we might have to cheat right now. I'm pretty sure this month was a quip. So, okay. So this is the actual first item in the box that I'm pulling out. I hope you guys can see it. I'll go pretty close in for you. And I'm going to read off the card. So... It is a ninja cord wrap. The dojo. They secretly await hidden until needed. They also are known for having amazing grip. Have you ever seen a ninja fall down off a building? Now you can wrap them up and prevent a messy situation. So I'm assuming this is for your cords. It would hold... It's actually so cool because... I have a cord problem. I, I have a serious problem with cords. Like, right next to my bed, uh, I have my phone charger, my PSP charger, my <laughs> um, 3DS charger. Like, all my chargers are right there for convenience because I just charge everything when I go to bed. So, I'm going to have to try this out. I think it will keep my cords nice and organized. And while we're on this sheet the subscription is for 
in independent magazine, so it is not Nintendo Power. I think it's it's pure Nintendo. That's what it's called. I wonder if that's what Nintendo replaced that with. I mean, it it would make sense, right, to have a digital thing now, since I guess that's that was the problem with Nintendo Power. People stopped buying it. I mean, I think I I was even getting it for free through their reward system, the Power Up. Oh, no, it's not Power Up Rewards. That's GameStop. Uh, I was getting it for free. Like they were giving it to me for free, so they were clearly having an issue with that. But it's actually for iOS and Android. It's not. I don't think it's. It, it probably is on the computer, but that is actually really interesting. So I'll have it wherever I go. That's pretty cool. Okay, and the next thing that I see is this. I already know this is candy. Um, I've actually gotten these before. If I had my bag with me, I could actually pull it out because I use the tin to hold things since I've eaten the candy. Get out of here. Look, even my dog knows this is candy. I'm not gonna complain about it because can't complain about it. It's another Mario block. What is it actually? Super Mario coin candies. Yeah, there we go. Is this what they look inside? You want me to, you know what, I'm going to try it for you guys since I couldn't open the Space Invaders candy for you last time. I'm going to do it. I'm going to try them for you. I don't know what flavor they are. Oh no, they're strawberry. Um, maybe I will not try them because I might be allergic to strawberry. Um, mm, I don't think I'm going to do it, guys. I think I'm going to wait. I don't think the candy I, I, I had before was strawberry. That's a little unfortunate. Uh, just don't want to have an allergic reaction on camera. Alright, so... That's okay, because I can still use the tin. My dog is absolutely going nuts over it. Oh my god, no way. <laughs> oh, I I have no use for this, but I know someone who is going to absolutely love this. So, oh, they're going to go crazy over it. Okay, so this is an 8-bit bow tie. This is actually adorable. It's, it's a real bow tie. Oh, <laughs> this is so cute. It is, um, I don't know if you guys can see the little Space Invader guys on it. That's absolutely adorable. Oh. Does it have a bell? Or is it, are they metal pieces? I think the metal pieces were clanging together. It's not like a bell. All right, the next thing in here is the Green Lantern figure. It's a little figure, and I don't know if you guys can see. It is Series Two Green Lantern? Um, is this supposed to be in here? <laughs> it's not on the thing. Hold on. Um, do they give me an extra thing? Well, I'm gonna, alright, we'll keep going through it, but I don't think this is on the sheet. Unless it's on the back? I don't know, that's a little weird. Alright, the next thing in here is... Don't panic, remember your towel. So it is a hand towel. It is actually a towel. What does it say for it? Oh, this is another thing from Graphic Lab. Um, if you watched my last video or got your own loot crate last month, um, Graphic Lab did this really awesome uh, cinch bag, I think they're called. It's, it's those like sports-like bags. Uh, for Mario Kart. It was it's actually pretty cool. So this is a custom made thing. What is it anything specific about it? I've 
back to it. I want to, um, I feel like it's a Hitchhiker's reference, which I have never read. <laughs> May 25th is Tao Day, and now you're equipped for travel. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna have to look that up. Actually, leave it down below. Is this a Hitchhiker's reference? It'd be interesting to know. Now the next thing in here is a Iron Man paper craft, which you cut out and assemble and it'll be this little Iron Man figure right here. And that's all of that. It's actually on really high quality paper. Um, there is a link to I'm assuming the artist at mine or minecraft <laughs> mini papercraft.blogspot.com so if you want to check that guy sky out see more from him just visit that link ask an adult for assistance <laughs> okay and the last thing in here is they are stickers. They're actually really cute stickers. Inanimate stickers until now. Talking to these inanimate. Oh, 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 You put these on inanimate objects and you can make them like. <laughs> that's adorable. I've seen this on like Think Geek and stuff like that. So that's cool. I wonder if this is where it's from. No, it's from Fred and Friends. So, everything in my crate should have been one year digital subscription to Pure Nintendo, an 8 bit bow tie, Don't Panic Towel, the Ninja Cord Wrap, Super Mario Coin Candies, Inanimate Stickers, and the Papercraft Iron Man. Um, so, there is a photo contest, my looter card. It says absolutely. Absolutely nothing about this figure. I mean, I'm not. I would have loved the Joker more so than the Green Lantern, but I mean, I'm not complaining they're gonna extra item in here. I just I feel like it, it might have been an accidental thing. But that's that's really neat. I did show you, right? So. see if I can arrange everything all nice and neat for you guys here. This will be edited for you so that it's just not me fumbling around. Or maybe not. Maybe I'll be fumbling around for you guys. So I like how there was... Like, if they have to put candy in here, I'm glad it was only one thing and not multiple things of candy. That's not bad. All this stuff's really cute, though. Where's this bow tie? This, this right here, this bow tie, is absolutely my favorite thing in this box. Um, because it is a real bow tie. It is absolutely real, and it's adorable. And I, I'm gonna give this to somebody because I know they're gonna go absolutely crazy for it. I mean, I can't really wear it. <laughs> it's for a guy, but uh, the towel's pretty neat. Um, definitely want to try this little ninja thing. I'm going to put stickers on everything. <laughs> but, everyone, this... Ooh, I had everything neat and it just fell. This is everything in my loot crate this month. Uh, there will be a link down below if you guys want to subscribe for yourselves. Uh, if you do and you refer your friends, uh, you get $5 off on your next Loot Crate for every friend that you refer. So if you, let's see, Loot Crate's around $20 a month. If you get four of your friends to sign up, you get a free Loot Crate. So it's pretty, it's not a bad deal. Um, there will also be a, what is it, a um, code down below so that you can save some money on your first loot crate. 
um, yeah, on your first loot crate because you can't really use it once you're subscribed. If you want to go ahead and check out my giveaway going on right now, I am giving away a free Steam game. Uh, it ends at the end of this month, so you still have time to participate. Uh, up to five entries per day, uh, and you can enter as many times as you want. So I'm giving away a free Steam game up in um, up to the total cost of twenty dollars, but I don't mind going over the twenty dollars so long as it's not an excessive amount because Steam has weird prices on their games. Like they'll have games for twenty two dollars or twenty one dollars. So I don't mind going over for you guys. Um, you have to be a subscriber and you just have to comment on the video because that's that's how I'm choosing the the winner. So that ends at the end of this month. But anyway guys, I will see you all in my next video and I will talk to you all in my next Let's Play. So I will see you guys then. Bye! set a date for the uh, extra life live stream if you guys are interested uh, it's gonna happen on November 2nd uh, I'm thinking I think I picked a time there is a Facebook group I'll put it down below for that uh, if you want to keep updated with that and be alerted when the date finally comes here it's gonna be November 2nd and I believe I put it for I believe I put it to start either 11 p.m. November 1st or 12 a.m. November 2nd to, oh, that was my phone, uh, November 2nd to November 3rd at 1 o'clock in the morning. It's going to be a 25-hour live stream uh, to raise money, that was also my phone, for um, sick and needy children. Um, but yeah, it's going to be really fun. Even if you don't want to donate, no pressure. Uh, it's going to be me playing video games and hanging out with all of you guys. And I might do a giveaway. I mean, no one has shown any interest in a giveaway for that day or multiple giveaways for that day. So I'm not really thinking too heavily on that. But please let me know if that's what you want, if, if that's what you want to see, because I do not mind doing that. Um, let me know ahead of time though because I have to prepare for that and if I don't prepare for that in time I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm just such a popular person right now.